Hello. If it's important to you to know that your paintings will last and not fade over time, then it's vital to check the permanence and light fastness of each colour you use. If a colour has a permanence rating of double A or A, then the colour is going to have a very good resistance to changing as a result of being exposed to light in the atmosphere. These ratings can be found printed on the tubes. There are only three colours in the Winsor & Newton professional watercolour range that have a moderate B permanence rating. One is Rose Madder Genuine, which, because of its incomparable subtle depth and warmth, is still produced and included by Winsor & Newton. I have painted five swatches of five different watercolours, cut them out and placed them side by side. I have included three of the B permanence rated colours from the range and two similar colours that are rated A permanence. Here's alizarin crimson, which is B rated, permanent alizarin crimson, which is A rated, opera rose, B rated, permanent rose, A rated, and rose matter genuine, which is B rated for permanence. To demonstrate the effect that 100 years of UV exposure and gallery conditions will have on each of these colours, I'm covering the bottom half of the swatches with black card this is now going to be put into a light fastness testing machine in the lab, and over the next 100 hours, it will be exposed to the equivalent of 100 years of UV light. Removing the black card, you could see significant fading on the first, third, and fifth colours, as these are only moderately permanent. But look how unaffected the two permanent colours are. So if you're hoping your work will be displayed for years to come without fading, this gives a good example of how important it is to check the permanence of your paint before using it. I hope you found this interesting.